Welcome to the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign. This is the 37th week of the year 2016. The week begins on the 12th of September until the 18th of September. It is the week from the Magician. It's a wonderful week, people. It's a wonderful week. Okay. Uh, the color of the week is going to be purple and the energy vibration of the week is the number the number one and the number one is saying to you to have um, to have courage okay this is saying to you have courage you um, Aries people out there have courage because things are going to be just wonderful have courage as we look at the energy on Monday it's the world comes up. If you're looking for a relationship, there's a man out there. He's the love of your life. Um, you're going to meet him. The energy of love is so strong with the world. That means whenever the world and the energy of this um, uh, to, 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 um, twin flame comes in, that means it is um, a relationship that you um, should connect with and you should have. And that is going to be a love of a lifetime. As we look at Tuesday, you're moving away from something out of your life because something ended and you're moving away from something out of your life. There is a negative um, from, um, woman who is trying to block your way. Be careful about this woman because this woman, she is really just, you know, there's just some people who don't want to see other people um, get further in life. As we look at Wednesday, Wednesday, the energy here, it is the Hierophant and the energy of the Hierophant and these people are going to bring you luck. Okay, so you're moving away, away from something and you're going on to a group of people. Maybe you have changed your work or whatsoever because a woman was there and she was just annoying, you know, <laughs> but um, you got in a group of people and they're going to help you. You're going to be very successful and you're going to be be protected your relationship on Thursday is very good. Your relationship is now good. Um, there's, there's, um, you're, you're trusting your partner, which is very good. And this is just like healing whatsoever because you have gone through like messy um, relationships. And this relationship that is here, it's very good. It's trustworthy and it's a good relationship. On Friday, you're going to get the solution to a problem. And this solution is going to come. And whatever you decide to do, it is going to be extremely good. You're, you have triumphant over something that was happening on Tuesday. This is going to be good. The key is here. So you are going to get the solution to a problem that was going on. And it's going to be good. You're all, as we look at Saturday, Saturday, the energy is the high princess. She comes up and she brings you still hope. Whenever the high princess comes up and... You, you know, it's like that still to within you that you, you know that it's going to be okay. Okay. So that's what you're going to have on Saturday. On Sunday, the energy of inner strength comes in and the universe is going to bless you with something beautiful. Expect a surprise on Sunday, you guys. The overall energy, it was just um, negative people around you. People were just using you to get to where they wanted to go. And this energy is going to break because you find a way to, um, to release yourself from this situation. I want to say to you, and this is just so good because I'm looking back at your reading now and um, the energy of this man it's a masculinity so for all you gays out there it is also for you guys it's a masculine energy and this is a love of your life and this is a gift that was sent from the universe and whenever the world card come sometimes you're in relationships and you're thinking about getting out of it whenever you start thinking ab about getting out of it the relationship the universe always send that person who you know that twin flame or that soulmate that you should have this relationship with and it's it's it is a, a lucky relationship because this is going to bring you luck okay you guys um 
We are the energy that is here, that strength energy. It's a fire energy. And this is also good because this strength energy, the universe is blessing you and surprising you and bringing you luck because you have been going through like a, a sort of up and down. And it is saying to you with this, you are protected. Okay. I am loving this for you guys. And whatever situation you are going through, it's going to be a blessing. It's going to come out. Okay. Stay tuned for the general readings. The um, general energies for the week and the general energies for the week. Number seven, num number 37 is um, um, the third chakra. And the sh third chakra is your sacral chakra. And the... Um, I work with the 12 chakras, the 12 main chakras. Okay. And this week we're going to work with the sake, the, the sacral chakra. There is different type of chakra cards out there and I'm trying to find the unique one. And I will show, I will put up that chakra um, card. I have here the fourth chakra. Fourth chakra is a sacred chakra and you need to call upon Archangel the fourth chakra is the sacred chakra, Archangel Gabriel, because this card is saying Archangel Shamuel, call, call upon Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Shamuel, and these angels will touch open and activate and align your um, third chakra. That is your sacral chakra. I work with 12 chakras. We have more than 12 chakras, but we need like every day. And some people do not have the time. If you don't have the time before you go to bed and you lay in bed, you ask, you call upon the universe to touch open and align all your 12 chakras and ask the angels to sing over you. And that will break negative energies in the day and in the night while you're sleeping, because when you're sleeping, you're spirit will go to places it's like you and your mighty i am present will communicate and your spirit will go to places like some people um said oh my god i wake up and i'm so tired like es especially people who does healing work through their sleep time they will go to other places on this planet do healing work and come back there are some people who goes to their families or go like to series or to um orion um for help so and they go to schools for information download of information the next energy i have here is clean house whenever the energy of clean house comes up it is saying to clean your body mind and soul especially your thoughts you need to clean your house because a clean house when you if you have a house that is not clean you will see that the um the energy of love and riches and abundance it doesn't stay in there it is good if you don't have any time to clean your house um that you ask the angels to clean your house and bring in good energy vibration in your house um um, when clean outs come up, it can have to do with your thoughts, the things that you send out in the universe. If you are constantly jealous and thinking about somebody else and thinking about what other people have, and you are thinking, oh, this person has did and uh, bless them and say, I will receive the same thing when the time is right. Okay. Remember the next time you're going to think about something else that somebody have and you don't have them say to yourself. I bless this person. I'm glad for what they have because I am going to receive the same. As we move on, we move on to the oracle. And I love the oracles because it's like my grandmother speaking to me. And, <laughs> and the oracle, this one is sitting down. You're sitting down with your hands on your knees in a fold up position and you were saying a never ending stories. And I know most of the people out there, whenever you apply for a job and you get a letter that you weren't chosen, rejection is the best protection that the universe can do for you. Whenever a man reject you, whenever a woman reject you, whenever um, um, you apply for a job and you don't get it. It is the best protection. It's the way your guides and angels protect you because some of the times it's not the place and time for this. And this is one of those times when a lot of people, especially women, when they don't get the job that they really desire and they really want to have, they put their hands and it's a never ending story and it's the end of the world. It's just like those girls who go after the wrong guys and they reject them. Listen, people, 
every one of us has chosen to come on this planet to um, engage and learn from lessons. Whenever something doesn't go your way, it is the way that the universe bless you. When we start to understand that, we will understand that when um, we don't get something in our life, it's not a never ending story, but it's that our guides and angels and the universe are blessing us. As we look at the last um, energy that I have here, and this is from the wisdom, it is the metal king and he's here. And whenever he, he's here, he, he can work with you or against you, depends on you know, your energy vibration. And he's saying, have discipline. You need to have discipline and bore borders. So, you know, like sometimes you have your kids and, and they kind of like walk off the border and you need to get them back in place. This is one of those times you need to have discipline to know that don't eat that bag of cookie because you're going to just um, come on. You need to have the discipline to understand that not everything you want, you always get. And I'm saying have a wonderful week. Namaste.